this month we got the GM fuel cell vehicle. It's an interesting car. It's got a fuel cell powertrain, but it's put in a 2007 Chevrolet Equinox body style. So let's get to know the car. The GM fuel cell vehicle is a front wheel drive vehicle in this powertrain setup. It has three tanks for the hydrogen, carbon fiber tanks, it has a battery pack, and a fuel cell where the engine would normally be, and that creates the electricity to power the motor that runs the front wheels. Nothing fancy about the Chevrolet Equinox. It's a basic American uh, small size SUV vehicle. As you can see as we get inside of it and we'll start it up. The vehicle starts up with a normal key. You go and turn it on to two clicks. Like uh, the old diesel vehicles, it takes a little bit of time to warm up. Once it says turn key to start, then you do so. And the fuel cell starts to make power. So we wait for on the left hand side, you'll see a green car show up with arrows underneath it. That means the vehicle is ready to run. So the fuel cell does make some noise. It's not as quiet as you might think. You hear that little squeaking noise or little scratching noise, and that's the fuel cell itself make, taking in the hydrogen. And there is some exhaust noise. It's not the broom broom that we all have heard before. But there is exhaust coming out. But it's just water vapor. It's nothing else. One of the interesting things about the fuel cell vehicle is it has this video on the screen where the radio would normally play or the navigation system talking about how the fuel is coming in. You can see that by the green lines coming across the top. Coming into the fuel cell, turning into power, which is the yellow dots coming out of the fuel cell. Out of the fuel cell also you'll see blue. Blue is the water coming off out of the exhaust and you see it dropping out of the exhaust there at the very end. You may hear that blowing noise in the background. That's the fuel cell engine, or actually not since there's no engine, it's the fuel cell purging uh, moisture out through the exhaust. So that's the sound of the fuel cell. So you might be hearing a little bit of bass going and that's the awesome stereo system that's built into this Chevrolet Equinox. The fuel cell drives no differently than a normal vehicle. The only thing that's really different in it is how it's powered. The real key with the fuel cell is that you make sure that there you have a constant amount of fuel in the tanks because there's limited locations where you may fuel up the hyd with the hydrogen. On Beach Drive, I'm Bob Marker, WTOP Radio Traffic. And we're at UC7's Chris Nail catching some uh, magnificent uh, wind gusts today. Word of the day is wind, exactly. We are talking about some gusts about 30, 40, and at times about 50 miles per hour in some.